Good day, everybody. How are you all? This is Dr. Nandi. Today, we are going to talk about how to find a determinant. So, without further ado, I'll share my computer screen with you. Find the determinant of uh, this is a three by three matrix of which we have to find the determinant. So we will first find it out the traditional way. So if we expand this determinant uh, by uh, a first row and first first row, we will get expanding by first row, we will get by first row. is uh, determinant of A is equal to A11, A11, plus A12, small A12, multiplied by capital A12, plus A13, multiplied by capital A13, okay? Where A11 is uh, capital A, or let's first write the small a11. That is equal to 2. a12 is equal to, coming from the first row, component 3. And a small a13 is equal to 4. Now, capital a11 is equal to cofactor. And it's given by minus one raised to the power of first row, that's the one, that's first column. Because we are expanding by the first row, first column. So first row, first column is two, is small a11, capital A11 is minus one, uh, and then raised to the power of first row plus first column, one plus one. And then we have minor, multiplied by M11, sorry, M11, just 11, M11, which is called minor. What is a minor? So it is minus one, cofactor 11, minus one, one plus one is two, and minor 11 is, we eliminate the first row and the first column, and the determinant is minus four, six and zero minus five. Okay. Similarly, A12, A12, first row and second column is cofactor is equal to minus one. Now we have first row one exponent plus the second column, one plus two and then minor one, two. So it is minus one raised to the power of uh, two plus one is three. And this should be actually determinant, right? So determinant, now we are eliminating the first row and second column. So we will be left with zero, six and zero minus five. Now this is equal to minus one squared is one times Minus four times minus five is 20 minus zero. This one will be minus one raised to the power, I mean, multiplied by zero times minus five is zero minus zero times six is also zero. So this one is 20, this one is zero. Okay. And A13. Cofactor one three cofactor is equal to minus one. Now we are taking the first row and the third column. So raised to the power of first row plus third column multiplied by m one three. These are all multiplied by. Okay, so that will be equal to minus one exponent four. We are eliminating the first row and the third column. So the determinant will be zero minus four and zero, zero. 
So this is minus one raised to the power of four even power. So it's positive one, but it is zero minus zero. So this whole thing is zero. Okay. Now we have to find out the determinant of A is equal to A11 is the number two, as we have indicated, multiplied by A11 plus A12 is three, is A12 as we, a small A12 as we have identified, and the cofactor A12 is zero, plus A13, small A13 is four, multiplied by cofactor A13, which is zero. So this is equal to two times A11 cofactor, capital A11, which is 20, okay, is equal to 40. So that's your final answer. The determinant is 40. Now, there is a much easier way to do this, which I will show it to you in a minute. Let me create some space in a moment, in a minute, and we will show it to you. So, we are going to use uh, TI-84. So, use calculator TI-84. TI-84. Okay. So, what do I have to press? I will press. So, what are the keys I'm pressing? in TI-84. Second button. Second button. Then X minus one. Second and then X minus one key, which is in the first column. Uh, the fourth key, first column, first left column down. This is basically the matrix key. And then we will highlight on the top to edit, 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 okay, top row edit, then we will press number one, okay, which is, uh, which will take us to matrix A, which is B, Understand matrix A, so if I go up a little bit, matrix A is this two by three matrix, I mean three by three, three rows and three columns. So the first number in the calculator is number of rows, which is three. So type three, then hit enter, then type three. The second number is column. So it's a three row by three column. So again, so make it matrix A, a three by three. Sorry, take care of it. Let me use that. So it's a three by three. That means three rows by three columns. So once we make it a three by three, we hit enter. And now we are ready to enter the numbers inside matrix A. So for that, I need to go back to the original data, the original value for matrix A, which is this two, and then three, and then four, and then so if I enter two, then enter, then three, then enter, then four, then enter, then zero, 
enter, minus four, enter, six, enter. Last row zero, enter zero and minus. The minus is next to the uh, enter on the left, on the next to the enter on the left of enter is the minus, minus five. So the last row is zero, zero, minus five. So I have entered that information in uh, matrix A in the calculator. Now I'm ready to find the determinant. How do I do that? So let me go back here. Now you are going to press again. Second button. So let me change the color. Then, so again, next step. I'm pressing the second button. Again. Okay. Second button. Then I'll press the X minus one, X inverse button, which is in the first column, fourth key. Okay. Then I will highlight. Uh, I will highlight here. I will highlight not edit and the first row, top row, I go to edit. I'm uh, sorry, I go to math. So I'm instead of going to edit, I'm going to math, which is the second option. So go and put the key or the cursor on math. I like math. Okay. Then select number one. Okay, which is says in your calculator key will now say determinant DET <coughs> and like this. Okay, then again, second key inside the parenthesis, second key, second key. Then X minus one key, clear. Uh, so, <clears throat> second X minus one, then math, then number one is determinant, okay? Then you're going to press the second key again, and X minus one. So second, and then again X minus one, inside the parenthesis, then you are going to select number one. Number one, okay? And that will put you inside your parenthesis after determinant matrix A. Now you will put the right parenthesis and hit enter. Okay, and you get determinant of matrix A is equal to 40. Same answer as before, much easier doing it. So I will stop here today. So I've shown you both ways how to calculate uh, the determinant of a three by three matrix. Either you use the formula or you can use the calculator, TI-84. If you have any question, please write me a comment. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I appreciate that. And please let your friends know about this video so that you and your friends can subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the bottom right corner. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Take care. See you next time.